YouTube. Um, I have some new products. I did a little shopping. And I'm going to make this real quick. I bought the Evercream Intense Nourishing Shampoo. It's a sulfate free shampoo by L'Oreal. And it's eight and a half ounces. And I had kind of a problem with that. Um, but it lathers really well. I put probably like that much in my hand thinking I was going to use something for like every section of it. Lathered my entire head excessively to the point that it was hard to get it out. So, but yeah, that was really well. So this little eight and a half ounce tube will last like forever. Um, finally got Trust in the Naturals. And I got the Nourishing Moisture one. I think they have different ones. That's the one I picked. I'm really big on moisture. Um, these two things together, they had my hair like butter. They were really, it was really, really soft. I was thinking that <laughs> something was wrong with my hair because it was so soft. But these are really good. I have this in my hair now. Um, I won't know the end result until I wash it out tomorrow. Or rather today, it's like five, almost five in the morning. Um, I also just dropped them, picked up this product that I've heard a lot of naturals talking about came in their curl box in August. Um, it's the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair. Coconut curling cream. I also picked that. It was only five. I think they're five ninety-seven or five forty-seven or something. It was five something seven, so that was almost six dollars for that. And this is. It smells really strong. It smells like a really strong coconut scent. But this is the texture. It doesn't easily come out. Um, in fact, it doesn't even move my terms. It moves a little bit. But it's like this the texture of thing. It's really creamy. Um, I put it on like a section of my hair before I washed it. And it really defined my curls, but it seems like it'll make my hair soft. It'll make a good daily moisturizer for my fluffy sounds. Since I haven't been trying to define my curls that much, I've been just wearing a fluffy. Um one thing about this though. This is the same right here. Is they say it is mineral, no mineral oil. I see it right now. They said no mineral oil. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. FaceTime camera, kind of blurry. Yet the first, second, third, fourth. Ninth ingredient is petrolatum. Mineral oil, petrolatum. Vaseline, they are the same thing. I don't know why it says it's mineral oil free when it has petroleum in it. So that is something to you know. I'm not really concerned about that right this minute, but you know, just something to know. Seems like false advertising to me, but it's a five dollar product. What do you expect? Um, I got this the soft and free grow healthy milk protein and olive oil strengthening cream. Anti-breakage formula. And I think it's about probably the same thing, even though it doesn't claim to enhance curls. It's this green get up here. It's actually about the same texture as the can too. So I'm thinking I bought two things that are exactly the same. So it's a little thinner than the can too. And it smells, it smells kind of coconutty, but I don't know. I can't place the scent of this one. Um, it's like a cream milkshake. Uh, it smells like frosting. That's what it smells like. It smells like cupcake frosting. And um, it says it has omega 3s. I'm kind of scared of this one because it has protein in it, and I'm kind of protein sensitive, but I put it on my hair, and it didn't really do anything negative. This one doesn't have 
mineral oil, but it does have lanolin and beeswax in it, and they're pretty high up on the list. Like the beeswax is one, two, three, fourth. It's fourth, and it has potty quartz in it also. So, if you're watching out for that kind of thing, like that be for you. If you don't like fragrances a whole lot, neither of these is going to work. I'm actually kind of worried that this or this, either one of them, because they both have shea butter, but though it's pan to it's that shea butter. Um, but maybe the fragrance in these is going to break me out. I don't know why, I just think it might. But I'm willing to give them a try. They were cheap. Um, basically, I'm looking for something to replace or use an addition with my long gate because I am sick and tired of my neck being wet because long hair been a gel activator <laughs> your hair is wet all day so um well, yeah that's basically the purpose of this video said that I love the Tresemme Naturals I love the L'Oreal Evergreen I love the smell of the can too I don't like that they said they're metal or free and they have petroleum in them um and so far, it looks like I'm going to like both of those, but I have to see once I rinse all of this out. I'm going to actually use the can too, alone, but maybe just some coconut oil just to see what it does. If it gives me that like fluffy fro, that big fluffy fro, I might not have to use my gel all the time. That'd be a different style. But anyway, that's pretty much it. Just a pretty quick video. Which apparently now, under 10 minutes is a quick video for me. So I'm going to call this closed and I will see you guys later. Bye.